Good afternoon, everyone. Jonathan Davis here with Davis Auto Sports. Please pay attention to this entire video. We got somewhat of a unique vehicle for us. Uh, for all you guys that follow us and watch our videos, you know that we really try to bring you guys the nicest and cleanest inventory, no matter the make and model. Uh, we just, everything we try to bring to market is something special condition wise. Uh, this is not our typical vehicle that we sell here at Davis Auto Sports. However, with that said, um, what we typically sell is a premier vehicle at a premier price that you're going to pay the money for it because it's worth it. This is more along the lines of somebody that wants a very nice diesel truck, four wheel drive, but you don't want to go out and spend the typical 30, 40 grand that the market's demanding or even 25 grand uh, for a typical 04, 05 Cummins crew cab. So we're gonna do a quick walk around so you can see the overall looks of the truck. I'm the owner here at Davis Auto Sports. I'll be honest with you. I would bring this truck to my property if I didn't already have an older diesel truck there. Um, this truck fits the bill for someone that either A, wants a diesel that doesn't once again wanna spend that crazy money or a second or third vehicle or a second property vehicle where you may need a diesel but you're not going to be using it every day this truck can be used every day um it is surely capable so i want to first start off by saying this truck has been completely repainted not by us uh the paint job is good overall we did repaint the hood um the hood wasn't up to par the rest the rest looked a lot better than the hood so we painted the hood in the grill and that's going to be the best part of the entire paint job is what we did the rest of it however if you're capable of wet sanding and compounding and knocking down some of the orange peel uh it will be a very very good looking truck uh obviously the black grill the headlights have been updated newer style wheels new rubber all the way around newer rubber uh, rough country suspension on it that's relatively new but uh overall it's a very nice truck it's not our typical inventory i want to stress that you got a scratch here once again entire truck's been repainted um you got a touch-up area right there but we're shooting this on a new iphone 14 or 15 max whatever they are and I mean, the truck looks way better than your typical 04, 05 that's running the road. And most importantly, I'm gonna show you some known areas of rust where this truck doesn't have it. So, but you know, we, uh, if anything, we beat our vehicles up condition wise because we have a high standard here. The bottom of that bed, you have a couple little areas right there that are, they are what they are. You got a little push in area right there and a little push in area right there. So one nice thing about this truck, uh, compared to a lot of these trucks, is the bottom of the doors. They're in great condition all the way around. You can tell there, well, let me get this phone to focus. There's been no body work on this door, inside or outside. It's very, very, very nice. Usually the bottom of these doors are eaten up. Uh, the rocker and dog leg is in good condition all the way through. Once again, no body work on the bottom of these doors. Very, very clean all the way around. That's just a little bit of dirt in there. But everything looks good there here. The corner of these cabs are absolutely solid all the way around. Same thing with the pinch weld in here. Oh, so this is probably uh, something uh, to note as well. The truck has 245 on the clock. Uh, it's a 5.9 Cummins, obviously. I'll show you well, in this video. We'll drive it. This thing, I have driven this thing to my property numerous times uh, when my other truck was uh, had a load in the back uh, for the dump. But this truck drives on the highway 85 miles an hour perfectly. AC is absolutely ice cold. And uh, like I said, when we painted this hood, we actually stripped it down to the metal. 
Uh, we etch primed it, primed it, blocked it, sealed it, base coat and clear coat. Um, so that hood is gonna be looking good for years to come. Newer headlights in here. Um, fender is really nice. The wheels overall are in good condition, really good condition. And uh, we have a lot of pictures of the undercarriage. Overall, the undercarriage is very, very, very clean. Usually these trucks are nasty and funky and rusty. But what I was talking about with the paint correction with a little bit of the orange peel, and it's not bad. All I mean, factory vehicles have orange peel, but if you know how to wet sand, even a, a 2000 grit would knock that down, preferably a 1500. But this truck could really, really pop with a good paint correction. Um, we just, on this value of a truck, we paint correct a lot of our vehicles. We are slam busy. We've never been so busy uh, in 13 years of business. So we just can't dedicate two of my guys for a week paint correcting this thing. Uh, I'll show you the inside here in a moment. Bottom of the door, once again, very, very clean. Rocker as well, very clean. Let's see what, yeah, I mean, look, you're just not gonna find that on these trucks. I mean, you will, but good luck. Corner of the cab, all the way there, solid all the way through. Original back glass. Weston Oval side steps, Banks exhaust, painted rear bumper. I'll be honest with you, uh, if this was my truck, since everything's color keyed, I would personally get rid of that chrome bumper or prime it and paint it. Um, to me, it just looks a little awkward and I don't have a problem down in a vehicle that were, I just think if that was black, that's a sharp looking little truck right there, especially for the money especially for the money. 5.9 Cummins, this thing runs strong too. Uh, interior is very clean, non-smoker. I'm the owner of Davis Auto Sports. I don't smoke. I won't buy a vehicle that's been smoked in. I've had people come in here and trade in vehicles that I've smelt cigarettes. They tried to argue with me, say it wasn't smoked in and I won't trade it. They started taking money off. I won't buy a vehicle that's been smoked in. Check out this seat, that's just from my tail being on the ground getting undercarriage pictures this seat has not been dyed that's just the wet mark right there the bolster is nice and thick power seat this bolster has got a little bit of wear right there but not hateful at all look at the center console it's perfect you got a bunch of stuff inside here that comes with it as well Steering wheel's very clean. Dash, usually these dashes are cracked up. It's got a very, very nice upgraded sound system. You got a Sony head unit there. If you speak or see through those grills, you have infinity uh, speakers throughout all the doors. It sounds very nice. Headliner is completely intact. That's part of the contour. No sags anywhere on the headliner. I mean, it's a lot that this truck has going. It has both keys, remote, little wear on this door panel but it is what it is on that not much back seats you're not i mean for 245 this thing is clean clean and most importantly this thing drives a hundred percent carpets overall these are new these are new let's go ahead and crank this thing up ac's already blowing cold before it's even started good old cummins You know, the more I'm looking at this, I may uh, 
gonna have to bring this to my property and sell my F-250 I have there. You got your books, you got your manuals, you have your original equipment identification card with all your coding, keys remote, nice Sony head unit, computer works. Rough country shocks in the front, same thing uh, in the back, well, your leaf springs, but you do have your rough country shocks. Those are newer. You got your dual steering stabilizer up front with rough country as well. Pop this hood. I'm gonna tell you another thing. You can look at the internet today. It is hot as hell here in Richmond. It's muggy and humid. This thing, I've been running outside of my office. I pulled it up and I got a phone call phone call that I ended up being on for about 30 minutes and uh, this thing was sitting outside of my office idling with the AC cranking for 30 minutes and didn't budge one degree in temperature and this thing is nice for what it is okay let's keep all that nice sound system I don't want to turn it up because YouTube is going to boot us four-wheel drive works cup holders super clean cigarette lighters never been used there's not a burn in here there's not an odor in here uh, you got a lot of different you got a different cluster for the AC you got a for your windows oh also let me show you I didn't show you guys this real quick uh, the back bed has a really nice trifold top but also uh, you do got your floor mats in that container you got your uh, uh, another set of uh, coils suspension wise you got a bunch of little goodies in there all that's included you got a nice uh, I said trifold looks like a quad fold top um, so yeah all that stuff's included and there's some decent stuff in there as well so I'll leave those as a surprise for what it is but it actually is some, some damn decent stuff in there you're a Ford guy and you like a studded 60 F250 03 with a 03 turbo on the 60 let me know I may uh, sell you that and keep this I'm gonna tell you right now this AC is absolutely ice cold If you hear anything rattling, all that stuff in the back is sliding around. Those containers on that bed liner will move around. Nice screen on that Sony unit too. It's got a nice gloss to it. And I don't know if you're gonna find a truck with 240 on it, 245, that's this clean. Give this guy some room to come in. Power seat up works, down works, back works, forward works, tilt forward, tilt back works. And what's this guy? That feels like a, oh, that's a lumb, oh, the lumbar up and down works. Look at that. Uh, mirror out, mirror in, mirror down, and mirror up. Mirror in, out, up, and down. Window, window, window. That noise was because it had been in there for so long. All the windows work. Come on, guys. This thing is... <sighs> mm. She's got another 300000 left on her, guys. And no rust issues. That's the best part. You, you see the bottom of the doors. The rockers corner cabs 
you see these things driving down the road with just no doors left on the bottom. This transmission at some point in time had to have been replaced or rebuilt because uh, we all know the five nines run forever. Uh, there's no question about that, but these transmissions, let's just say they don't have the best rep. And uh, I don't know if I've seen a, a five nine with 250 uh, with the original transmission. I don't have any records but uh, as smooth as this thing is, I would be very surprised if this is the original transmission. I mean, this truck just, so this road is a big national road for uh, logging trucks. And uh, there are some deep crowns on this road. And usually you gotta fight this road a little bit. And I'm driving this thing one finger on the wheel, knees are not on it. Easy as can be going down the road. With a two inch lift. I mean, look at my finger, it's smooth as can be. Off the wheel completely, going straight, I mean. We'll let this truck pass. We'll give it some, some accelerator, let it drop a gear down. Super smooth. It's a nice truck, guys. If I had time in my shop, I would paint correct this thing, do a couple small little odds and ends, and sell it for a lot more money than what I'm going to be asking for it. So These seats are comfortable too. Very comfortable. Hard on the brakes. No vibration. Oh, look at that. Almost my same truck. <laughs> That's funny. four-wheel drive I didn't even move four-wheel light indicator shows that it's in four-wheel and yeah the way it's gripping this concrete she's she's definitely in four-wheel come out it's out no hard clinks yeah she's mm. I gotta stop this video the price is going up by the minute guys this is this is a nicer truck than what I thought honestly we'll go ahead and go through these gears As it budged the temperature, it's every bit of 92 degrees a day and humid and nasty out. Man, I love these engines. All right, guys, I'm gonna end the video. Y'all see what this truck is. If you're in the market for a nice, nice little diesel at a very affordable price, uh, this is the one I want to reiterate. This truck has been painted. Um, it is a decent job. We did the hood and grill. That looks fantastic. Um, the undercarriage of this truck is very, very clean. We're going to have pictures. There was some very light surface rust on some parts of the bare metal frame. You could hit this thing with a, uh, an air hammer. Um, this frame is solid as can be all the way around. Very, very clean truck. I doubt this truck. If you're viewing this truck on eBay, uh, it's not going to last long. Go to our website. You can leave a deposit on our website at davisautosports.com. We use eBay a lot just to advertise our vehicles. So whether we have a buy now or a, a auction bid price, uh, you do not have to buy it on eBay. And if you're viewing this on YouTube, make sure to go to our website to get more information on the truck. Um, 
as you see, still have not budged one degree in temperature. This thing drives as smooth as can be. Very nice truck. Thanks for viewing, guys. Have a good one.